Floop Networks introduces the Fiber OneShot Pro, a first response, single mode fiber troubleshooter. The one button test feature locates severe bends, high loss splices, breaks, and dirty connectors at distances of up to 15 miles, or more than 75,000 feet or 23,000 meters in less than five seconds. With the Fiber OneShot Pro, you can save and store up to 99 test results for later review. It reports up to nine events per fiber link and never needs calibration. Whether you're troubleshooting FTTX, hybrid fiber coax, or fiber links between central offices, or working on regional or rural access networks, the Fiber OneShot Pro is your first line of defense. There's no training required or confusing data to interpret. This one-button handheld tester is ruggedly built for the outdoor environment, yet comfortably fits in your hand. Now, let's take a closer look at why the Fiber OneShot Pro is an innovation in fiber testing, its features and benefits, some applications, and some frequently asked questions. Fiber OneShot Pro, service provider, fiber troubleshooter. Most troubleshooting solutions for today's fiber networks are inefficient and take too much time. Simple tools like lasers and VFLs, visual fault locators are easy to operate, but extremely repetitive and tiresome. Most VFLs have distance limitations of two or three miles, 3,200 or 4,800 meters. At the high end, optical time domain reflectometers, OTDRs, can work as troubleshooters, but their advanced analysis and trace capabilities are better suited for certifying and documenting cable installation quality. The Fiber OneShot Pro fills the void between a VFL and OTDR by providing an affordable first-line diagnostic tool that locates fiber cabling problems accurately the first time with no interpretation and fast results. The Fiber OneShot Pro performs the following tests to help you find incidents on single-mode fiber optic cables, measures the distance to reflective and loss incidents, measures the reflectance and loss of incidents, Maps the connections in single mode fiber plants by showing the number of events on the fiber and the distance to each event, up to nine events. Cleaning, adapters, and making measurements. The Fiber OneShot Pro features an output port with SC adapters and UPC end phase. This adapter can be replaced with another adapter such as an LC adapter. It is important that you only connect UPC connectors to the troubleshooter. For APC testing, use Fluke Network's optional UPC to APC patch cords or UPC to APC launch and receive fibers. Note that the optional launch and receive fibers are often used to give the troubleshooter a better view of the first and last connectors in the link. Without a launch fiber, the tester may not detect the loss of the first connector and without a receive fiber, the tester may not detect the loss of the last connector. Fluke Networks offers a variety of launch and receive fibers with SC, ST, LC, and FC adapters. Let's take a closer look at how to perform these measurements. First, clean all fiber connections using either a mechanical device, swabs, wipers, or solvent. We recommend using the IBC one-click cleaners that can be found in Fluke Network's fiber optic cleaning kits. Prior to testing, clean the bulkhead connector, the launch and receive fiber connectors, and the connector on the fiber cable under test. Next, connect the fiber to the troubleshooter. Turn on the troubleshooter, and notice the display briefly shows pass if operating correctly. Press the test key. The top of the display shows check active as the tester looks for an optical signal on the fiber followed by testing. The troubleshooter automatically saves the results and will store up to 99 test results. Because this is a dark fiber tester, if there is a signal stronger than approximately negative 29 dBm on the fiber, active line will blink and the tester will not perform a test. If active line blinks, immediately disconnect the troubleshooter from the fiber. Optical power levels more than plus 7 dBm can cause damage to the detector in the troubleshooter. Interpreting the measurements. In just seconds, the test results are displayed. Loss and reflectance of incidents on the fiber are measured as well as the distance to the incidents. In this case, the bottom right-hand corner of the display tells us we have three events on this fiber. 
The first event displayed is the loss of the first connection and the distance to that connector. The distance shown is the length of the launch fiber if one is connected. To switch between loss and reflectance measurements for an event, press the menu select key. Using the up arrow to scroll to the second event, the distance to that event is shown. The distance includes the length of the launch fiber. So if the tester shows you an event at 190 meters, the event is actually at 60 meters if you are using a 130 meter launch fiber. Using the up arrow to scroll to the third and final event, the display, in this case, shows the distance to the end of the fiber. This is indicated by the distance reading followed by break or end. You'll also notice that reflection limit is flashing, which indicates the reflectance is higher than the limit. This is good for locating breaks or contaminated or badly seated connectors. Also, loss limit will display when the loss of a connection is higher than the limit. Both of these events could be due to a dirty or damaged connector end face, a connector is loose, a fiber has a bad splice or sharp bend, a connection between fibers of different types, severe macro bends and micro bends. Both the reflection and loss limit can be set through the menu screen. If the up arrow is pressed once more, you'll notice event zero of three is displayed. This indicates connection to the troubleshooter, but could also indicate no fiber is attached or that the connector is dirty if this is the only event shown. Comparison. Now let's run the same test with other products and notice the differences. Before even pressing the on button, you'll notice the large size and shape of these two units compared to the Fiber One Shop Pro. The Fiber One Shop Pro is thinner, lighter, faster, and easily fits in the palm of your hand, allowing for easy operation with just one hand. Powering on the unit, a long startup time is apparent. After a startup time of more than 60 seconds, the unit is ready to test and we press the scan button. After a lengthy scan period, the unit returns a graphical result with several events that require extra time and interpretation. Powering on the second unit, the unit is ready to test and we press the run button. After 30 seconds, the unit returns a graphical result that requires more interpretation. The additional effort of placing cursors on the graph, zooming in and interpreting the waveform results further extend the time and effort. After looking at a couple of other products, it's easy to see why the Fiber One Shop Pro is highly respected by its users. The form factor makes it easy to use and comfortable to grip. The time to run a test is much faster. Test results are displayed in just five seconds. Results are accurate and easier to interpret, eliminating confusing and time-consuming cursors and graphical readouts. The user menu and interface is more intuitive with one-button testing, and the cost of the Fiber One Shop Pro is less expensive than other products in its class. Settings and features. The Fiber One Shop Pro offers the following user programmable settings. Backlight settings of 5 to 60 seconds, index of refraction, IOR, default 1.468, readings displayed in feet, meters, k-feet, or kilometers, loss limit, 0.5 dB for lower loss to 6.1 dB for higher loss, the default is 0.5 dB, reflection limit, negative 24 dB for large reflections, to negative 62 dB for smaller reflections. To change a setting on the tester, hold down the menu select key until the settings menu shows. Select a setting to change using the up or down arrows to scroll. Press the menu select key to select. Use the up and down arrows to change the setting. Press the menu select key or test key to save the setting. To exit the settings, Hold the menu select key for four seconds.
the troubleshooter is capable of approximately 1,500 tests before having to replace the AA alkaline batteries. Frequently asked questions. When and where to use the Fiber OneShot Pro? Troubleshooting. Video service to Fiber customers is down. Diagnosing fiber troubles with inexperienced technicians or techs who don't normally work with fiber. Locate breaks or potentially weak network cabling areas. Severe bends, high loss splices, and dirty connectors. Locating potential sources of bit error rates. Reflectance caused by end phase contamination or poor connections. Analyzing the channel. Quickly confirm connectivity by verifying all the links and connections in your channel up to nine events. Long range testing. Perfect for large service provider networks, telecom, CATV, enterprise, metropolitan areas, rural areas, regional carriers, and campus environments up to 75,459 feet or 23,000 meters. Compatible with all pond wavelengths, 1310, 1490, 1550, and 1625. Other key applications of the Fiber OneShot Pro include finding breaks or events in fibers caused by car or utility pole accidents, power or lightning burns, projectiles or dig ups, trees and animals, craft person troubleshooting, including splicing error and misplaced jumper or wrong connections, location of loose, broken, or dirty connections, fractured or damaged fibers caused by excess pooling tension, establishing an active fiber, or diagnosing no light situations. The Fiber OneShot Pro is your first response, single mode fiber troubleshooter. In just five seconds, it locates and diagnoses severe bends, high loss splices, breaks, and dirty connectors in up to 15 miles of fiber. That's more than 75,000 feet or 23,000 meters. You'll be able to save and store up to 99 test results for later review. The Fiber OneShot Pro reports up to nine events per fiber link, and it never needs calibration. The one button test feature and easy to read LCD means no training required or confusing data to interpret. This innovative tester comfortably fits in the palm of your hand, yet is ruggedly built for the outdoor environment. Don't let fiber cabling problems take down your network. Cut your average job time and save money by investing in the Fiber OneShot Pro from Fluke Networks. For more information and to test drive the Fiber OneShot Pro with our online virtual demo, please visit flukenetworks.com slash the one. Keep an eye out for more new and exciting products from Fluke Networks. Thanks for watching.